Okay, well, welcome in today's class. Let me give you the agenda for today, people, and what you're actually going to be doing. Okay, so you're going to take a hard look at your grade and to what work you need to take a look at to do. And we're going to, we have a specific way we want you to do it. Here are some details for you. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do, you're going to get the slide. You're going to, you're in Pear Deck already. You're going to get the slide and you're going to start filling out with your current math grade. Simply go to Google Classroom and fire your current, your current grade. Whatever that is, it's a number grade, right? Go find it. It's in your Google Classroom. Okay, if you don't know, let me know. Okay, then I want you to total the number of missing assignments. Anything with a zero, right? Not including Alex, right? So anything with a zero, not including Alex, how many of them are there? Total number of missing assignments. Three, four, five, one, zero, right? Some people don't have any. That's good. So put that right there, okay? Now we're talking about some most recent assignments, okay? There's three things I want you to answer here. First, have you finished Monday's homework? Remember, it posted yesterday. It's due tonight at 9 o'clock. Have you finished Monday's homework? Circle that, yes or no, okay? Second one. What's your grade from Friday's assessment check? Remember, you had an assessment check on Friday. What's your grade on that? Okay. And the third one is, how many topics have you learned this week in Alex? Remember, that started Friday. So remember, it's only Tuesday. So from Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, the last five days, how many topics have you learned so far in Alex? Okay. So I want you to answer those questions first. If you're not sure the answer to some of those, or even the Alex question at the end, let me know. I'll help you answer that question. All right. The question is, remember, we want at least one done before we get to Thursday. So here we go. Let's talk about where this is going now. Talk about your plan for today. Okay. So what you want to do is you're going to do one, two, three things today, maybe more depending on your time thing and how much you can get done. Okay. So the first thing is I want you to know what's your first task? What, what are you going to do first? out of all this, right? And I would suggest that if you haven't done Monday's homework or you haven't done Friday's assessment check, do those first. Then get some Alex done. So those last three things on the left, Monday's homework, grade on Friday's assessment check, and Alex, those really should be your top three priorities, right? So the same thing here as I go, I'm looking for the second task, number two, and the third task after that, right? And then here are your options. As you can see, your options are Monday's homework, Friday's assessment check, Alex, see the top three? Those are the top three. Any other missing homework, right? Say you're finished those three. Do you have anything else missing? All right? If you do, do it. Also, get extra help. If you're struggling on something and you're not sure of something or you got something wrong on an assessment check or anything is confusing you, this is the time. So I want you to fill in Task one, two, and three with something there. Monday's homework, Friday's assessment check, Alex, any other missing a homework, right? But be specific, which one you're going to do, right? If you want extra help, put that down there, right? We want you working. If you got everything done, you got Monday's done, you got Friday's done, work on your Alex. Use this for Alex time or to make up anything extra, all right? Anything extra that you're missing. All right. That's the idea. That's what I want you to do today. So right now, as soon as you're done watching the video, I want you to go and fill out this information right here. And then as soon as your plan is done, you can start. All right. So this should take us a few minutes to answer all these questions here. And then I want you to start doing this. I'm going to be seeing what you're doing. Remember, this still counts for class participation. You must do something on your list in order to get credit for participation for today. All right. So let's go, people. Let's fill this out and let's get a lot, a lot of work done so we can improve grades and make things even better going forward.